This story is about food waste. The EPA says there's more food in our landfills than any other single material, and it's making climate change worse. Here's what happens. When food rots, it produces methane. That's a greenhouse gas 28 times more potent than carbon dioxide. Food waste emissions contribute to global warming almost as much as road transportation. Food waste is a part of daily life in America. And according to the Environmental Protection Agency, it's responsible for about 8% of global greenhouse gas emissions. The UN Climate Summit, more than 100 countries signed a pledge to limit emissions of methane, a greenhouse gas that's a leading cause of global warming. Leaders talked about cracking down on the oil and gas industry, but there's one source of methane that may surprise you, what we put in our trash. Here's ABC's Dan Lieberman. When you think of climate change, you think of culprits like cars, industrial and power plants. But Justin Green is focused on the food from your fridge. Hello everyone, I'm Michaela Agusta and I'm nine years old. I'm an author, storyteller, and I'm a founder and tutor of Zenamika online learning platform for kids. Did you know that food waste can destroy our planet? And did you know that BSF Magnet can reduce the food waste? Based on this question, in this project I chose Save the environment with food waste as the main topic. I chose it because food waste is a major global problem. According to United Nations Food and Agriculture Organization, one third of the food produced each year and about 1.3 billion metric tons are spoiled or simply tossed out. Food thrown into our garbage bin ends up in the landfill. Food waste in the landfill breaks down in a way that can create greenhouse gases which cause global warming and climate change. Extreme weather, rising temperature, less clean water, increased blood fires, and many more. It needs a solution. And VSM Nugget is part of the solution. People need to learn the effect of food waste and what we can do to reduce it. As an honor storyteller, I believe that storytelling is a powerful weapon to educate people. So that's why I use storytelling at my project. The title of my project is Finding Maggie. This story is about Sarah's adventure to find Maggie to save her planet from the food waste monster. I will bring you a closer look at the effect of food waste and what we can do to reduce it so we can save our planet. This is my AR project display. In this project, I use three apps, Pictoblock, Studio Gometa, and Canva. First step, I created the AR using Studio Gometa app. I put my AR project which contain of infographics about food waste and BSF maggot in the end of the story. You can scan the QR code using Metaverse app on your mobile phone. These are the background for my project. I designed the background using Canva app. Last step, I created the story using Pictoblocks app. These are the codes. I will show you my project. To start this animation, you just need to click green flag button right here. Hi, I'm Sarah. I'm a secret agent who lives in the Planet Blue. This is Planet Blue. People in the blue light hoarding the food waste. Food waste everywhere. Since then, a food waste monster named Waston attacked Planet Blue. I'm Waston, the food waste monster. I will destroy planet Boo. Waston makes all of the food waste there produce gases which trap the sun's heat and Boo. The gases cause the global warming and climate change effects there. Extreme weather, rising temperature, less fresh water, and increased wildfires. Boo is in danger. I get a mission from my captain to find Maggie, the BSF Maggie Ranger who can save my planet. Maggie lives in the planet Mago. Sarah goes to planet Mago using her spaceship. Arrived in the planet Mago, Sarah feels amazed because the planet is really clean. No extreme weather, no rising temperature, more clean water, and no wildfires. 
How does Planet Mago can be this clean? Then, Sarah meets the little creature. He's asking to Sarah because Sarah is looking for help. Hi there, do you need help? Who are you? Do you know Maggie the BSF Nugget? Hi, I'm Milo and I'm a BSF Nugget. Maggie is my leader, and she's at the laboratory right now. Alright, let's go to the laboratory now. In the laboratory, Sarah is looking for Maggie the Maggot. Hello, I'm Maggie. Hi, I'm Sarah and I'm a secret agent from Planet Boo. I really need your help, because Watson the Food Waste Monster attacked my planet. Will you help me, Maggie? Of course. Let's go. Sarah, Maggie and Milo go to Planet Boo. Milo eats all of the food waste there, and Maggie defeats Watson. I will clone myself to eat all of these food waste. Planet Boo becomes really clean. Then, Maggie gives a box of BSF maggots to Sarah, and she explains about the BSF maggots and food waste. Did you know? Food waste thrown into our garbage bin ends up in the landfill. Food waste in the landfill breaks down in a way that can create greenhouse gases, which cause global warming and climate change. You need to process your food waste to save the environment. This is a box of BSF maggots for you. BSF maggots is the larvae of the black soldier fly. They can easily grow on food waste. They're especially efficient at converting into body mass. It's making them a good choice to processing food waste. About 2.5 pounds of BSF maggot munch through 5 pounds of food waste in about 4 hours. By using BSF maggots to process food waste we will be able to get several benefits. Reduction of food waste, production fertilizer, nutritious animal feed, and biogas. After that, Maggie and Milo go back to the planet Mago. They say goodbye to Sarah. Since then, Planet Boo is always clean from the food waste. People in the Planet Boo process their food waste using BSF maggots. The end. To stop this animation, we just need to click the red button right here. I completed my animation using an AR project. You can scan this QR code using the Metaverse app to get more information about processing food waste using the BSF method. If you scan this QR code, you will see the display when you play it. Alright? Now let's scan this QR code. Now we just need to click this button. This is the display. You just need to click next. Click next. need to click this thank you button and it will end. Alright, so that's all from me. Thank you and see you next time.